Hi, the English Doctor from MM Medical. Uh, today I'm going to talk about how to buy clinical skills, experience, the knowledge, how to buy it. Okay. Uh, always you spend so much time as a healthcare provider, such as athletic trainer or ortho uh, resident family medicine resident, emergency medicine resident, they spend so much time uh, at the game and hopefully, you know, you see injuries such as shoulder dislocation, elbow dislocations, fingers. Uh, it's unfortunate for athlete, but happens. And then hopefully, you know, if you're a healthcare provider, you get to see those actual injuries and you get to practice reduction, which is, you know, actual reduction is the practice. And that's the old way. And it's hit or miss. There's no guarantee you're gonna see it. Uh, you know, I used to work for high school setting for 20 years. So I, I know, like I, you know, I saw one or two shoulder dislocations uh, every year, football season. And, but I don't know when I'm gonna see it, but I know, you know, one or two. And it took time, you know. Uh, First year, somebody come off the field, you know, holding the shoulder, my shoulder is dislocated, who can reduce it? I would look down and say, no, I don't know how, I'm not doing it. You know, that's normal. And if you're brave enough to reduce, and of course there got to be a system, uh, you know, in place, such as a doctor, they support, uh, encourage you, recommend you to reduce or try to reduce dislocated joint. Uh, and also there's, uh, uh, you know, your school system or school district or university or any kind of institution, they, you know, back you up, they support you. And also the state. Uh, I'm in San Antonio, Texas, and Texas is, I'm not sure, Aggressive is the proper way, but we are very open trying to, you know, approach the injuries. We are trying, trying to solve the problem. So, and again, all, uh, there's a doctor and then uh, the institution, the state, they support what we do as an athletic trainer. So we reduce. I do when I see it. Do I recommend? Do I encourage you? I do not. Uh, I'm trying to protect myself. Yes, I am, but I'm not a doctor. Okay, it's a judgment call you make. And again, there's a system, there's a support system, the doctors group, and they they help you, support you. Then you do. Then that's what that's why I do it. Okay, so you need to find where you at. All right. Well, uh, go back to the trying to buy clinical skill. You cannot buy it, right? Buy it always because. You just spend so much time, and again, I mean, there's that's the only one way, you know, that old way was because it's a hit or miss, and you're there. Let's say you got three uh, athletic trainers on the field, and then there's uh, one shoulder dislocation happened, and just all same time, all three just graduated program, just the first game and the first injuries, and then you got opportunity to practice reduction. However. Only one get to do it, right? Because, I mean, how are you gonna have other two that's gonna practice? Just only one. And then one is the, the first one, and let me try, right? So there's always last one, or uh, other two in this case, they, they don't get to practice, okay? So the other two gotta wait for how long, when, who knows, okay? And that's for everything. I mean, any 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 joint and also any any level. And I realized that that's the problem, and got to be a solution, right? Just think about it. CPR, mannequin. Okay, if you are instructor or you ever play with it, the 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 mannequin, it just the uh, uh, one of the pro uh, product. Just a little core in the middle in the chest. And little metal clip on the metal, and if you compress enough, then they make a just make a noise, clipping noise, which means you're compressing deep enough. That's the medical simulation, medical simulator, in a sense. And I got to be.
got to something like that for, you know, orthopedic, sports medicine, emergency medicine, athletic training setting. Got to. Well, I could not find it. I, there's nothing there. So, uh, just be honest, uh, one day I was drunk as usual and then just, uh, you know, I'm going to make my own. So I decided to make my own. Uh, and actually, days uh, I uploaded the uh, video from the beginning to the end on the YouTube channel. Uh, if you wanna uh, check that out, it's it's a long journey. It took for a while, but that, that's how it uh, started it, and then how it came out as a product for shoulder dislocation later. I mean, we already made the elbow one. The finger is on the development. It should be ready within within a month, hopefully. Okay. Uh, so, medical simulation is the key, is the answer to buy clinical skill, experience, and knowledge. Without the patient, without the risk, there's no harm here, okay? You can make a mistake, you can, you know, just do it in the wrong way, it might go in, okay? But it's okay, it's just you, you wanna practice, okay? And you can practice now, okay? Practice, mer practice makes perfect, you know? But how are you gonna practice? You couldn't, but now you can, okay? So, uh, our simulators, shoulder and, and elbow, there's no simulator. You get to practice as much as you want without the wrist, without the patient, okay? And uh, so basically is you are buying the time. You're buying the clinical skill, okay? It took for me to get 20 years of experience. I mean, you know, 20 years. But those 20 years you can buy in, by using my simulators, you can buy in 20 minutes. If so, maybe, I don't need it. I don't think it's gonna take me five minutes. You can practice reduction techniques as many as you want. And in five minutes, you know, then you, you gain the skill in five minutes. It took 20 years for me to gain. So, if you are interested in the program, uh, an athletic, tra athletic training program, you're interested in our model, please let me know. Okay, contact toki at mn-medical.com. Uh, we got about 30 programs, 30 plus athletic tra training program in the United States. They purchase our models and they are, all the students, they are doing hands-on, you know, uh, practice. They're gaining the clinical skills. They are buying clinical skills, you know, and without the patient, without the risk, nothing to lose, okay? And I get a feedback or comment about we don't teach, we don't teach, we don't need to teach reduction technique, uh, you know, and athletic training program. We don't, we don't teach. They said, well, we discuss about it, but we don't teach. The KD standard doesn't say we have to teach. We discuss and that's it. And that's how you approach. Uh, you know, that's how you com comply with the KD standard. And, uh, you know, I, I, I got nothing to say uh, because some uh, program directors say, no, you know, we have to teach. That's how we comply. But some doesn't see it that way, I guess. So, uh, finger dislocation later, uh, this is a prototype. Uh, it's coming within within a month. I'm hoping it's, it's uh, April, 2023 and then the first week. So hopefully, hopefully by end of this month, uh, okay, it's gonna be uh, like shoulder, well elbow dislocation later. Actually it's the exact same, the uh, shape, the size of just the upper arm. And uh, just uh, 
middle finger part would be the one you can dislocate. Okay, so it's gonna be like middle finger. So, uh, price would be 1400. I believe that's the price we're gonna go for. So, uh, if you need a quote, again, send me an email. Approach, uh, con uh, was DM me, then I can give you a, a quote. Okay, so thank you.